we do need to take sufficient precautions. And my hope is to be able to implement within our school entire education system a safe management framework that others can also refer to. And I think there are four aspects to a holistic safe management framework. It has to involve screening, hygiene, cohortization, and then safe distancing. Let me just briefly touch on each. Huh? One is screening, essential is health screening. If you're sick, don't come to work. We have been doing that in our schools at the gate. If a child has a fever or not feeling well, sore throat, cough, they don't come to school. We actually isolate them and get their parents to bring back. So it's not just temperature. We have always been screening for flu symptoms, uh, all flu symptoms for the children. Number two, hygiene. So school will continue to go through daily cleaning and disinfection, especially the high-touch areas like railings and door handles. Hand washing, wipe down, we've been doing that and we'll continue doing that. Number three, cohortization. This means forming bubbles around each class and minimal cross-mingling between the bubbles. Uh, so in line with that, CCAs, tuition, enrichment, center-based learning will continue to be suspended because all these bring together students from different class and in fact different schools together to mingle. So I think it has quite high risk. So as the first step of this roadmap, we will suspend all those activities. Fourth aspect of safe management is safe distancing. So in classroom, we will arrange exam style sitting with each child, uh, children about one meter apart. We will stagger recess and then during recess, fix sitting in canteen, also with one meter apart at least. And then arrival and dismissal will as far as possible also be staggered. So if there are many schools or a few schools in one neighborhood, we may stagger their start time to deconflict the traffic. Uh, during dismissal, we can stagger by mode of transport. So if you are walking from home, you can go first. Then those taking school bus can go next. Those which taking private cars can go finally uh, go last and you spread out, spread out the traffic.